Hey guys, I hope you're doing fantastic. Welcome into fill number 16. This one's a lot of fun. So let me break this down for you. So today we're going to be playing this fill in two different subdivisions. One, we're going to be playing it straight as 16ths, and then we're going to be playing it as 16th note triplets. So first we got to get comfortable with the first component. So the first stickings are right, left, left, kick. So we're going to accent that first right ghost note which means play very quiet the two lefts and then we're going to throw a kick in there so we got to get comfortable looping this right left left kick right left left kick so let's practice that Okay, so the next step is just throwing your right hand over on the floor tom and finishing off with an accent on the snare. So the whole thing together, right, left, left, kick, floor, snare. Right, left, left, kick, floor, snare. Right, left, left, kick, floor, snare. So let's loop that together. So the first subdivision we're going to fill this in is 16th notes. So we're going to count this as 1 E and a 2 E and a 3 E and a 4 E and a and then out. So what I'm going to do is play one bar groove, one bar of this fill as 16th notes, nice and slow. Now we can begin to move that right hand around.
Now the next way we're going to fill this is 16th note triplets, so that would sound like this. So we got one and a one and a two and a two and a three and a three and a four and a four and a one. Next thing you can do to get creative with this is we can add in right left left kick as a variation. So the whole fill is right left left kick right left, but we can add in this right left left kicks in the front of it to change the phrasing of it. So let me experiment around with that and add some different variations of this. Now you can try to add all these things together, the two subdivision fills and the right left left kicks making different variations. so you can see this could be some good vocabulary to have in your arsenal so you can play this fill in all different kind of ways so I'd like you to take this fill and practice it with your grooves and make it your own practice this stuff creatively and I'll see you in the next lesson